Okay, g'day everyone, it's Orlando Raw. Good morning, good morning. We're going to do today an Aussie or English style breakfast in Italy. In Italy, you can't find everything. So I'm going to show you how to uh, try and do the things the same using simple Italian ingredients and might even taste better because in Italy, a lot of food has no coloring and has no preservatives and is very genuine. So let's have a look at our items today. So I got a set of bacon, which you can buy in a supermarket, which is very expensive. I got this um, from Sardegna. This is from Sardegna, which is an island near Italy, which is also Italy, Sardegna. And this is guanciale, affettato, guanciale, ham. It is not the same as the Aussie bacon, but this is better than the stuff they sell in the packets, calling it bacon. This is pretty good stuff. I've got my mushrooms. I've got two eggs. I've got all over the world eggs. Okay, now for the baked beans. Usually we use Heinz baked beans. And um, I'm going to be using, these are already been cooked in vapor. These are called cannellini. They are small, see those, cannellini, cannelli, cannellini, these are smaller, cannelli, the type of bean, the white bean, okay? And to make the Heinz beans, I'm going to use, cook them with the Heinz sauce, because uh, as if Heinz is going to make baked beans with another sauce, they're going to use their own sauce, they're going to make two types of sauces. So I've done that many times, this tastes pretty good. So what we're going to use here today is we got our guanciale from Sardegna. This is a very good quality. This is the best near bacon I had in Italy and it tastes good. Two eggs, five big mushrooms, large mushrooms. I got a little can of cannelli, which is uh, not so big. It's 150 grams. I got my ketchup, Heinz, because Heinz makes the best be baked beans, okay. Got some butter, and I'm using, to do my toast, I'm going to use a five cereal bread, because I'm into that at the moment, so I'm going to use that. Okay, so breakfast is a very energetic thing, it starts the day, so you have to eat a lot of proteins in the morning, okay. So, another good thing about making breakfast is that you have to be fast. So I'm going to be cooking four different things at once. At the moment, I've got the toast going. Once the toast is done, I'm going to put it aside, let it cool down a bit, then I'm going to put the butter. I'm going to cook the mushrooms. I'm going to just divide these. These are pretty big. I'll divide them in six parts, just like that. Okay, six big pieces. And I'm going to cook the mushrooms in butter, which is a thing I discovered on a YouTube channel from an English woman. And since I discovered it, oh, it's great. I'll cook it with butter any day. It's so fantastic, it's perfect. Okay, for the morning, that is excellent. It's real good taste. Okay, so I'm cutting the mushrooms. They're getting a pretty big cut, you know, big pieces. They are big mushrooms, so just cut them in about six parts. One cut one side and two cuts the other. Six part mushrooms, big pieces. Okay, I got my mushrooms done. I'm gonna cook the mushrooms in the butter on one side of the pan. On the other side of the pan, I'm gonna put my beans and the ketchup. On another pan, in the same time, I'm cooking four things together because breakfast has to be all together. I'm gonna to be cooking the pancetta in its own fat without putting oil. Okay, when this cooks up and starts cooking, I'm gonna throw in the eggs and my eggs, you can do eggs, eggs, eggs is like coffee, you can do 1,000 types. 
Okay, I love my eggs burnt underneath, not really burnt, but cooked. And on top, I want the egg yolk to not get cooked, because I like dipping the toast in that. And anyone that likes it scrambled, you just grab the eggs and with a fork and mash it around. And when you put it in a pan, just turn it around and the scrambled eggs. I'm going to put them whole in the pan and I'm going to make the eggs spread out. And the top, I'm going to just put salt on it. Does I don't cook the top because I want to dip my bread in it and I love that. That's what I love about breakfast. I love my bacon. In Italy, you can't find bacon. That's why I'm doing this video. For Aussies or English or Scottish or Americans, you come to Italy and you're living in an apartment or you're on holidays or you're for work, go look for this. Sardegna, that's a symbol of Sardegna. And it's guanciale. Go pick it. Some uh, real white. This has a bit of red meat so it's better it's like bacon this is top stuff that's why i'm doing a video and you haven't got the heinz beans yeah they do sell heinz beans at some places but it's so expensive like we're paying about four euros for a can crazy this probably costs not even 50 cents because they're coming free and it's a small can and you get the ketchup you can make it every bloody day for a year <laughs> okay you don't need much of this out my toast uh, while I was speaking maybe I cooked them a bit too much but they're okay okay it's gonna cool down there got the mushrooms cut up now let's go to the action and cook okay so on the side of a pan this is a bit scratched up but I don't care I'm starting to cook the butter and just because we're in a rush it's already melting I'm gonna start putting the mushrooms on this side of the pan because I'm gonna cook two things in the pan so I'm gonna keep it on the side because I'm cooking four things at once. So we'll just put the mushrooms there and they'll start cooking in the butter. If you need extra butter, just put it on the top. Okay, while that's going, on the other side, I'm gonna put my beans. There you go. And they're gonna start heating up. It's not hot yet, so I'm gonna touch up my fingers. There you go. That's going to start heating up and that's the first process. The mushroom is going to cook in the butter and I'm going to put the hind sauce on top of that and that'll cook. I haven't even put oil and I'm putting the bacon strips gently inside and these all start melting with the heat. They're using its own fat to cook. Why, why, why put fat to cook fat? Why do I have to use oil to cook fat while, while it's going to cook in its own fat? And it's going to be healthier because we're eating bacon and it's already fatty and the best thing is I'll just put five strips of bacon look at that that's all fat there that's gonna cook itself and with the oil of this I'm gonna cook the eggs people are gonna say what the hell is he doing there is the sauce Heinz sauce I just put a bit of that there just to heat it up yeah I mean the beans are already cooked they're already been cooked in vapor so they're already okay and I'm cooking the mushrooms and in the meantime, here is the bacon getting cooked, the guanciale the, from Sardegna. I'm going to just turn that over straight away. Okay, so I've got the beans just getting warmed up. Okay, look at that. Well, and the mushrooms are all taking over a bit to cook. That's okay. And I put the whole packet because it's only 100 grams, so it makes more oil and I can cook the eggs. Look at that. No oil, it's cooking itself that is healthier okay hey, when you put an eggs out see how they came out intact when i break it in half i turn it straight away on one half so i keep the yolk inside and then i pour it out and that's how i get the yolk always not breaking okay on the eggs i like it with salt on top right there there you go top Okay, so here we go. Look at that bacon. Look at those mushrooms. The mushrooms uh, have to be cooked fast because uh, mushrooms contain a lot of proteins, a lot of nutrients. And if you cook them too much, they just like getting cardboard. You don't get the benefits of the mushrooms. The baked beans, they look good. They look the same. Nice two eggs, eggs all over the place, all over the world. They're all the same. I've got my five cereal toast with the melted butter, let's get into it. Okay, so this is a perfect way to start the day. In Italy, a lot of people eat 
small drink, a small coffee and a, a croissant. And that's their breakfast. They have a fast breakfast in Italy. They go in a bar, they don't like drink a cappuccino for 15 minutes or 40 minutes, like in some places in Australia or the rest of the world. They go there, they got a coffee, boom, that's it. Five seconds, ciao, and they go to work. Okay, or they go wherever they want. They go to their lava, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, um, talking about breakfast, Breakfast is what starts the day, so eggs keep you satisfied and keep your hunger for long hours. So eggs is very good for you, it's protein, it's the best. Fats, a lot of people say, oh, eating fat, bacon, that. every now and then it's good for you. It is good, everything is good for you if it's genuine and everything's good for you if you eat it in moderation. You don't want to eat every day this stuff, okay? Mushrooms in the butter, the butter is a problem. But don't use margarine because it's worse. But the mushrooms are big. Mm. And that butter catches a good taste. Because they're big, the mushrooms, we're keeping the qualities. All the qualities, the, the nutrients and the benefits that mushrooms give to you. If I cook these a lot, it's like not eating them. Don't eat them at all. It's, it's like eating cardboard. It doesn't give you nothing. So just the time the beans get heated up because they're already pre-cooked. You buy them pre-cooked. These were vapor beans, already vapor, pre-cooked. I just put the sauce, warmed it up, warmed it up. These mushrooms, mm, the beans, mm -mm, perfect. And this, guanciale. Guanciale is usually white, the fat part of the meat. It is very, very cut thin. And I found this type that has a bit of meat, the red, and this is beautiful, mmm, crunchy, and I've been a lot of years away from Australia, I bought bacon in the shops here, which I sell bacon, it costs very expensive, you have to be me and to have breakfast here, bacon eggs every day, but this costs a little bit, I put 100 grams, which is right, you could divide it for three people, I'm having breakfast for lunch and dinner today. <coughs> Sorry. I'm having breakfast for lunch and dinner today. And eggs, people always complain they want them this way, they want them that way. I want them cooked underneath and I want them raw on the top. I just put salt to cut them. Mmm. Eggs are very orange. Dip my bread. Breakfast. I love the English Australian style breakfast. You can't say nothing about that. I love eating and I have to eat this in the mornings. Not every morning, but sometimes I benefit and I remember those good old memories of Australia when I was a kid and I grew up in Australia. So a big thumbs up, hit the notifications button, subscribe.